ladies and gentlemen, this brings us to our main event of the evening. This is a professional MMA bout in the featherweight division, scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Out of the red corner, Josh Huber. Hellboy! I watched one of Huber's early fights, uh, our ringside position, Dr. Alex Constantinidis and I were talking about it in Colorado Springs. That's where Huber's out of, a place called the Ice Palace where the waitresses were the roller derby girls. Yes. So back when it was the proverbial underground sport. <laughs> and I'll tell you, one thing with Josh Huber, you're gonna see a guy that has given his all, really one of the best legendary fighters from Colorado. Agreed. Uh, that, you know, and he's had big fights in his career. He's been on a big stage before. He's taken big fights before. Did he get all the way to where he wanted to go? I don't know, but he's had a hell of a career. And as much as we talked about the toughness of LT Nelson, that's the kind of doggedness that Hellboy Huber brings into the cage. I've watched him fight where he blew out a shoulder, continued the fight, where he broke his clavicle in the first or second exchange of the fight. Kept thinking to myself, he doesn't seem himself this evening. Found out later it's because his clavicle yeah. was broken, but he fought three rounds. I mean, that's the kind of guy that Mr. Huber is. Yeah, very much in that LT Nelson mold. I mean, listen, do yourself a favor. You've never seen LT before tonight. Go back and look at some of his bare knuckle fights because it'll blow your mind. I will, will do that. Joss Hellboy Huber going to hang it up after this. What a career it has been. Out of the blue corner, A.J. Robb. Out of Jackson's Wink, New Mexico. I believe, I could be mistaken, but I believe started out in Colorado Springs. And uh, A.J. Robb, an up and coming fighter, very much deserves to be fighting on a fight at the level of Josh Hellboy Huber. But it's kind of old school versus new school. And I think that's just pretty exciting for the fans. Yeah, you got a guy that's that's looking to make his way up and a guy that's tipping his cap on his way out. And, and that's that's a different style fight. Like, you're in the middle of your prime. So you haven't been there yet, but that's a different style fight with one guy coming and one guy leaving. Checking out our tail of the tape here. Huber the Elder at 37 years old, a little bit taller, 5'9", versus Rob's 5'7". Of course, they both made the 145-pound limit. Huber's record, wow, so much experience at 24 and 12 wow. versus the legal murderer, A.J. Robb, with a five and two record. This is gonna be a good one. So, yeah, I can tell this is gonna be a good one. A.J. AJ Robb is a stud. That guy works hard. It's gonna be a good one. That he does, yeah. He's, uh, like I said, one of the top up-and-coming prospects, and Huber been at the top for a long time. So, both these guys with with a lot on the line this evening. Expect them to put it all out there. Man, it's, there's been some ebbs and flows on this fight card tonight. I mean, I was looking forward to that Petrosian fight, not knowing what to expect in that one. That and was not what I expected. No, it <laughs> wasn't. Not what he expected either. And yeah. then, then you're coming off the high of watching five unbelievable rounds of highly skilled MMA. Absolutely. AJ Robb is a tough dude. You, you can see, you Take can it see up it. to you Josh see Stewart. Take it up to Josh Stewart for the official introduction for our main event of the evening. Ladies and gentlemen, this brings us to our main event of the evening. This bout is brought to you by the King of Beers, Budweiser. There is only one King of Beers for the King of Sparta. Hey, let's go. Let's go. This is Sparta! Fighting out of the red corner! He holds a professional record of 24 wins, 12 losses. From Compound BJJ, Denver, Colorado, Josh the Hellboy Huber! Fighting out of the blue corner with a professional record of five wins, two losses with Jackson Link MMA 719 Fight Team. 
from Widefield, Colorado, AJ Smith Brown. Well, AJ sold some tickets. Yeah. <laughs> That's what that'll tell you. <laughs> Standing up, room only up. here. Got them lined up against right, the back wall. The main event. You gave I gave you instructions earlier this evening. I know this is going to be a good fight. Questions blue corner, questions red corner. Hook them up, gentlemen. Let's fight. JR, do you know do you know the last time Hellboy fought? I, I can't recall specifically. So it's been a while. Uh not a super long time. No? Okay. Touch your gloves, punchy kicky chokey time. Here we go. Main event of the evening. Pro MMA action. Five five-minute rounds. Robka starts out with that leg kick. Heavy leg. Huber with the front kick. He got hooked at that ankle pick. Yeah, you got to watch that there. He got that crank in. Yeah. Front headlock by Rob. Huber has himself almost all the way out of it. Fighting hands right now. Huber, Rob not going to be able to lock that up with just one hand. Nope. Huber, very experienced jiu-jitsu fighter. Training out of the compound. Rob Huber going covered to up, yeah. Ground and pound from top. Nice job. Utilizing his strikes and goes to the legs. Nice ankle control by Rob. Yeah, he's unable to get the uh, up kick. So there's Huber that gets to his knees. Now can he do anything with it? Quick throw by pass there by Rob. Huber Ooh, uses a hard game. shot to the rib cage. Man, oh, beautiful body shots by Rob. Those body shots. I mean, Davion talked about body work. Man, those, he's, he's taking them out. The more he leads into the body, that guy cannot breathe, you can tell. Rob used a sort of a modified cradle position from standing in order to bulldog tip Huber over. And now maintaining top slash side control from half mount. Got it, got it deep in there too. Huber looking to cage walk. Rob, good job turning him back into the cage. Oh, they're just dropping some elbows too, JR, just one. There's another one. Well-versed game by Rob here. The Hellboy is showing, he's showing that he has some resiliency. Yeah, there's no doubt there. Looking to feed through the choke. Huber onto a hip, shuts down some of the choke. Rob and again with down. the post, then elbow. Right on Rob. the temple, yep. Classic ground striking technique. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh he took some Huber big shots hurt. there. Huber's going to have to show something yep. here. Every try, try tries to get up. He tries to Rob's get up. Yeah. yeah. Good movement by Rob. Nice hips. Davion, you talked off camera about the toughness of AJ Rob. Oh yeah, absolutely. You can just see he, he wants this fight. He wants to get uh, Hellboy out of here. He's just relentless with his pressure. Yeah, really good yeah. pressure. Nice point, but because of that, it has slowed down a bit on the striking. Mm -hmm. Hellboy surviving though. Got two minutes yeah. left at this round still. Boy, that seems like a yeah. long two minutes. AJ Rob has to be careful not to blow his wad, though. Good point. You have some gas in that yeah. tank. Not, not yeah, good. Huber's the guy that'll hang around in the yeah. fight. He doesn't want to get Let you wear yourself out. Yeah. Good doesn't... scramble by Huber there, get full guard. He doesn't want to get too excited going for that finish. He needs to continue to pace himself and not, you know, not slow down toward the end of the first round and then go into the second round all tired. Go fast, but don't hurry. Exactly. <laughs> I know that all too well, trust yep. me. You been there? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Huber opens up the guard, starts to move his hips for position. It's a tough lesson to learn when you, you get that gas tank runs out, Absolutely, isn't it? man. It's, man, it's brutal. Rob backs out of the guard, starting to favor the leg kicks now. Huber's deciding how he's going to get up, but oh. Rob's continuing the pressure. <laughs> Those are big Brutal kicks. kicks. <laughs> oh, that man. might be it. Hellboy didn't Yeah, I think Huber was yeah. injured on that. Yeah. I believe he signaled to the referee that yeah. he was injured by one of those kicks. Yeah. I'll tell you that <laughs> right there. That guy's a warrior. Would you would have seen him at his best. Yeah. 
an unbelievable fighter. I wish I had seen him in his best, but tonight was AJ's night. And congratulations, yeah. AJ Robb, going home with our main event victory on what has been an outstanding card here this evening. Man. Highlighted by that lightweight battle. But AJ Robb, listen, put it all together and really, he didn't give Hellboy much of a chance if, if you're looking at the replays. Yeah, just really good with his positional control, able to take advantage of where he wanted the fight to be, going with some occasional ground and pound. And then once he came back up to his feet, just a brutal attack to the legs of Huber. Man, AJ was, that was a definition of relentless. No doubt about that. Was that was the most relentless performance yeah. I've seen tonight. Pressure from beginning to end. We're gonna take it up to Josh Stewart for our final time this evening. Oh yeah, that, that hurt him too. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Tim Mills called a stop to this fight. Three minutes, 59 seconds into the first round. Declaring your winner by TKO, AJ Champ Rob! Man, good for that young man. Sparta, are y'all not entertained? AJ, beautiful fight, baby. How you feeling about that victory? And, and, and what was your game plan going in to this fight tonight? Whoop that ass. Simple as that. Get in here. Whoop that ass. Show everybody I'm ready for the next level. UFC, Bellator, whatever. We're coming. <laughs> hey, hey, and you got the middle name, the champ. You obviously manifested. Your mindset is strong. Yeah, you want to you. go ahead and head straight to the top and get that belt. You look like you're ready for that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Next fight, going to be for a belt or, or whatever. Uh, uh, we're just going to keep, keep chipping away and get to where we want to get to. UFC or bust, that's what we're here for. Get to the UFC and whoop ass for the next five, six, seven years. I'm in the game, I'm gonna continue to whoop everybody's ass until I'm done with this shit. Man, open up whoop ass, <laughs> and that's what you did from beginning to end. Who do you wanna call out for your next opponent? Do you have anybody in mind? What's next for the champ? Hey, I got a tattoo on my left hand. It says A-C-G-I, anybody can get it! <laughs> anybody can get it! Hey, give it up one more time for all. The champ! Thank y'all for coming out. Spot of 95. Lightweight was on fire. Let's go. What a great show. Fight fans, thank you so much for having joined us. Mr. Franklin, Todd Romero, I am J.R. Gordon. We appreciate you having been here this evening. What a great show it was. Congratulations to A.J. Robb in our main event. Congratulations to LT Nelson, three-time King of Sparta champion. We'll see you at the next round of fights.